The 30th OSCE Foreign Minister's Session will be held in Skopje, the capital of North Macedonia. One of the central topics is Russia's war against Ukraine, and for the first time since the beginning of Russia's full-scale invasion, Federal Foreign Minister of Russia Sergei Lavrov will be present at the OSCE meeting. The government of North Macedonia has authorized the overflight over its territory of Russian planes that will transport the delegation. The Ukrainian Foreign Ministry said that Kyiv refused to participate in the OSCE session because cause of the decision to allow Lavrov to attend the meeting. The presence of a Russian delegation at a ministerial level meeting for the first time since the start of Russia's full-scale invasion of Ukraine will only intensify the crisis into which Russia has driven OSCE. We should work together to save the OSCE from Russia, rather than sending signals about the possibility of returning to pre-February 2022 forms of cooperation to the state that unleashed the largest armored aggression in in Europe since the end of the Second World War. Oleh Nikolenko, speaker of the Ukrainian Ministry of Foreign Affairs on Facebook. The Baltic states are also in solidarity with Ukraine. Representatives of Lithuania, Latvia and Estonia will not attend the OSCE ministerial meeting. The Baltic states' diplomatic chiefs said in a joint statement that Lavrov's participation may legitimize the aggressor country as a member of the organization and downplay its brutal crimes in Ukraine and violation of OSCE principles. We're dancing to a fiddle that being played by Russians and I don't agree with that. If there is an organization that could be called actually brain dead, we will very much have a chance to see the OSCE becoming this. Gabrielius Wansbergis, Minister of Foreign Affairs of Lithuania, in a comment to Bloomberg. The representatives of other countries do not plan to block the meeting. Representatives of the United States and the European Union explained that their task at the meeting will be to oppose Russian seethes and manipulations. They note that they do not plan personal meetings with the Russian foreign minister. I will go to the meeting of the OCE. We have to go. We are a member of this organization. And we have to, to present our views and, and counter the views of uh, Russia. Once again, they cling to the notion that they need to preserve some opportunities for dialogue, for diplomacy, for interaction with Russia. But Russia is just working to undermine any international institutions and it's just important for Kremlin to show that their supposedly influenced decision-making to block, to destroy. I think this is just a global approach. When they can't influence decision-making, then they can at least block everything. One of the topics of the Skopje meeting will be the election of a new OSCE chairmanship. North Macedonia was previously expected to be succeeded by Estonia, but Russia and Belarus vetoed the decision. Soon Malta, which positioned itself as a neutral state, was offered the chairmanship in 2024. But Russia blocked this option as well. Reported by Anastasia Tarnavska, Nikita Skoblikov, UATV News.